A top member of the Federal Election Commission, Commissioner Trey Trainer, sided with 45th President and leading 2024 presidential candidate Donald Trump over far-left Manhattan District Attorney Alvin Bragg's frivolous indictment against Trump. Trainer compared Bragg's persecution of Trump to trying to make a square peg fit into a round hole. A Manhattan grand jury voted to indict President Trump over a $130,000 payment to adult film star Stormy Daniels made by his former lawyer and now convicted liar, Michael Cohen. Trainer said the Stormy case is not a campaign finance violation. It's not a reporting violation of any kind. I don't know how you get around the evidence that both the Department of Justice in their investigation of the federal campaign finance issues and the Federal Election Commission in their ultimate jurisdiction over campaign finance issues, neither of them found there to be any violations whatsoever. And I think the jury is going to see that and they're going to have to rely upon the fact that both the law enforcement experts and the civil enforcement experts, as far as campaign finance are concerned, didn't find any violation of the law here, Trainer said. On Tuesday, April 4, Daniels lost another case against Trump in the Ninth Circuit Court where Trump was awarded $121,962 in attorney fees. In March 2022, Daniels was ordered to pay Trump $300,000 after losing a defamation case against him. Also on Tuesday, Bragg held a press conference and told reporters he doesn't need to specify what Trump's crimes actually are because the law does not so require. The indictment does not specifically say what those crimes were. What laws were broken, a reporter asked. The indictment doesn't specify because the law does not so require. Bragg shockingly answered.